What is up, Rad Potential YouTube? Welcome to today's most epic accomplishment video, yet the worst filming slash just get it done filming video ever. So, in this video, we are in this video we are fixing to get it the race car started. We get the race car on a trailer. We get the race car painted. We get the race car not back to my house, but you get to see it in the sunlight at the paint shop. And before y'all leave, I want to give a huge thanks to the guys at the body shop and the guys that Calvin knows and our friends from back home who came and helped us get it done in a weekend. So the paint's done. Enjoy the videos of that. All right, quick update here. We've got rally tires. We've got LRB speed parts and the rally tires are just snow tires. Keep in mind, the car's super light. Most rally cross guys run snow tires anyways. They generally wear out too fast for a rally. But to prove to you guys that the race car's not here, look at that. That's a shop full of couches. And I'm fixing to clean the shop, maybe paint some walls in the shop. And we're going to overhaul the shop this week because the race car's not here. And I get to take a break from working on cars. So enjoy the video. The car firing up. Again, mad shout out to Calvin. He provided the footage at the end of the video. And uh, thank you guys very much for watching. This is huge. This is huge. Peace. All right, guys, first start. We just buttoned everything up. We got brakes. We got the whole deal. We's about to make some noise. Theory. Power on. The charger's probably gonna grind. Don't worry, it'll do it one out of ten. Woo. Well, guys, guess what? It's running. Good enough that uh, we can do that. But uh, we have this issue. causing it to die right maybe no it's not having enough fuel pressure so as soon as it tries to draw fuel out of the injectors it just has no pressure at that point so but you can definitely tell that it wants to run right it definitely wants to stay alive and running timing's good we're about a centimeter past the first one so that should be about 10 but how about that startup though too Wow, but I think because that header is so damn short, it's on the bend. I don't know. Might just be me. Thank you. 
All right, what's up, guys? We are in the body shop. Jump from where we were at with Charles helping us getting the thing running. We have since hauled the car up to Indiana, and we are spraying some paint. So, fortunately, kind of unfortunately, Calvin's got to stay here and work, even though he made a big mess of himself earlier, which is kind of funny. Yeah, kind of went everywhere. <laughs> and uh, we've got the last bit of everything. I'll show you real quick, not making too much dust. Um, hood fenders, bumper, and the rims, which those are the wheels. In the booth, Calvin's going to spray those down, and I am going to get headed back to Tennessee here shortly because still got a work day job, and I got to be three hours away. Yes, so, Calvin, let's go with this real quick. What are your thoughts? White. It is white. So. Calvin says this is straighter and cleaner than the rotary truck, which it might be, but the, uh, the rotary truck, we didn't have nine RX-7s to be able to pick the best parts from to be able to put on this one. We kind of just had what we had for the rotary truck, and the time frame for the rotary truck was also shorter. way shorter. Yeah. So, um, I don't know, what do you think? I think it laid out pretty good. I think it did too. We had a couple little spots to fix, but I think all in all, pretty good. Can't really complain. Yeah, and then huge thanks to him as well because I'm going to leave and this is still very much in the way and he's going to take care of it and then put it mildly back together and then haul it to Tennessee for us this weekend. So this week, Thursday's video, we won't have any rally car stuff. Next week, we probably will. And uh, dang, it's just so nice to see it all, you know, white, white and shiny. Yeah, not like, primer white. Not primer white, you know? And then like the interior stuff you can see, it's not a perfect, perfect match to the, the like white, white that I sprayed everywhere else. Um, but I think it, in the sunlight, it's gonna pop. Yeah. So. And by the time you get the seats and stuff in there, you won't be looking directly at the bulkage and everything yeah. anyways, so. I mean, For sure. It'll be good. Yeah, I think it came out epic. And we were, we worked real late last night. If you saw the picture I posted, um, we got at the booth about 2.30 in the morning and then came up here today. A little bit dragging in the morning, but we made it out here and got it put together. And, uh, you know, huge, huge thanks to Calvin and also the rest of the guys here at the body shop for letting us do this. We uh, definitely do our 100% best to uh, stay out of everyone's way. We come in on the weekends, work late, just to make sure we're not here when other people are. And uh, we definitely clean up everything. So we make dusty messes on stuff. We move cars out of the way to not dust them. We wash the floors, because we basically hosed out this whole spot, the whole spot up there. I hose the booth out before we use it, so it's nice and clean. We try to make sure everything is left way better than when we, we got here. Um, just because we are, you know, using somebody else's stuff so it is uh, always best to leave it better than you found it and definitely could not have gotten it done you know without their help at least not in the time frame we wanted and you know for without spending a spending a bunch of money and it if we'd have painted it in my garage these like couple specks of dirt that we've got over here you know from me peeling the tape and there being dirt under it and like that that would have been like the whole car probably yeah. so especially white I'll, uh, I'll put the link, but y'all should go check out the video where we fixed this area here, which you can see is legit perfect. And then also when we fixed this area here and there's now a bug on our roof. <laughs> Scratch the paint. Scratch the paint. I gotta like stabilize my Can't touch it. This is like operation. <sighs> Can't even tell. Mint. Yeah, other than my fly in the middle of me spraying clear <laughs> coat. Yeah. And right here. I'm like, you gotta be kidding me. So, oh, oh, you can't see it. We're no, I it up, but... Yeah, he ca caught a fly on his pocket screwdriver and just smashed it in the glass to show him, the glass of the boot to show me where it was. So, all right, well, Calvin. Yep. Thanks for the help as always. Sure. I'm gonna head back to Tennessee. Thank you guys very much for watching. See you next one. Keep it red.